achieving right now? I'm totally overwhelmed by what Fran has achieved. It's just such a remarkable feat to, to, to cycle and run all over the country to all these 44 grounds. It's just, well, beggar's belief, quite frankly. I mean, I've never known anything like it. And uh, to raise for such a worthy cause, I'm delighted to come here to Reading this evening and we've got so many people here to welcome Franny and, and rightly deserved. I think it's just just an unbelievable achievement and well done, bud. Thank you. you, you thank you very everything. much. Thank you, thank you so much, John. Thank I hope you. we're in the New Year's honours list. There you go. <laughs> what does it say about his mental strength, his physical strength and his desire to raise money for cancer research? Well, it just says it all, doesn't it, really? I mean, look, he's fresh as a duck. Well, he's almost as fresh as Daisy. It's all right. It's, a bit it's, right. The, it's the good lighting. It's, it's good, good lighting. No, but, I mean, to come here and then, you know, having cycled all that way today, run all that way today, and then have to meet everybody here and so on. Look at him, he's absolutely right on the money. It gives Fantastic, me, yeah. It gives me a huge lift seeing the, you know, you know, the welcome that we get at each of the grounds and especially here. It's been rightly wonderful. deserved. So gives... Rightly deserved. But I mean, you know, I mean, what a guy, eh? <laughs> Great. Great. Well, well, Friday. Friday. Public. Yeah, no, it was a, a big day in many ways. Just that, that step closer to finishing at St Mary's and taking in all the, the London clubs and then finishing up here at Reading this evening. It's, uh, it's another club that um, sort of goes off the list. So we, we, we're down well, in, well, not even, it is single figures now, isn't it? It's only a handful now. So, um, and, the, and the welcome that we've received here is, is incredible. There's been so, so many friends and family and well wishes that have come out and joined in today that it's been incredible. So yeah, one wonderful way to, to finish the day. So yeah, very, very happy. I'm tired and still a bit sore, but um, you know, it gives, gives me a huge lift when you, when you get a welcome like that. What did it mean to have Kelvin join you on the bike for the last one and to see two Southampton players in Stephen and Shane welcome you here at the Medeski? Yeah, a wonderful hat-trick of, uh, of, of players to turn out. It was, uh, you know, Kelvin's just such a great guy and known him for a long time now and um, for him to come out and get on the bike in the dark as well, I mean, it's, it's not, not easy to be riding in the dark. The safety element's a little bit touch and go and it was a little bit wet at times, so he, he kept up with us certainly, and he's flying along, and, and then to see Stephen and Shane as well. They, they, you know, great guys. It just it speaks volumes for what they are as people and as players. Well, I think uh, what he's what he's attempting to do and what he's going to do is is nothing short of, of phenomenal. So to show a bit of support and, and come out and uh, you know just let him see a few friendly faces and, and give him some uh, a bit of encouragement and keep him going is uh, is a big thing. It was a mile on the bike for you with him as well. That was the added extra, wasn't it? Was that I some did, nice surprise uh, I did for him? a few miles, yeah. Tried to, tried to surprise him, but I'm not sure if he realised I turned up or not. But uh, <laughs> it was good. He pulled me around a couple of times, which was, uh, which was important. He was, um, no, he was, he's, he's a superman. He was, uh, he was powering up the hills, and I had a job to keep up with him at times. Shane, Stephen, what does it mean for the current squad to be here showing presence, you know, from the playing squad, support for Franny? Yeah, I think he's inspiring um, everybody taking on this challenge. It's uh, a huge task to take on and there's a little bit of light at the end of the tunnel. So obviously we've been away in the international break. It was nice to be here tonight and see him and support him. And um, Great credit must go to him for, for taking it on and, and raising uh, so much needed funds. Shane, we saw you when the race was launched at Staplewood. It'd be good to see him back at St Mary's at half-time on Sunday, won't it? Yeah, he's on the home straight now. You know, um, it's a hell of an achievement what he's doing. 100 miles a day is, is no easy feat and all we can do is support him you know he, I think he needs our support to get more of the line and uh, yeah hopefully hopefully he gets that from us. Just finally chaps what does this say about the mental as well as physical strength of Franny that he's been able to go through this for 13 days already marathon every morning 75 plus on the bike every afternoon. Well, I think that says everything about his character you know I think uh, you know, if, if you need inspiration from anything, what he's uh, what he's achieving right now and what he's doing every day, um, yeah, he's a he's a strong guy, and uh, you know, I think that at the end of this challenge, I think everybody realise uh, you know what a fantastic achievement it is, both physically and mentally.